Welcome to another Sourcegraph user training tutorial. In this video, I will walk through how site admins can sync Git repositories to Sourcegraph from their code host. Sourcegraph integrates with your code host to help you search, navigate, and review your code. In today's tutorial, I will integrate my Sourcegraph instance to a GitHub code host. To get started, head over to your Sourcegraph instance. In your Sourcegraph instance, Go to the top right hand corner and click on your avatar. Then navigate to the site admin panel. In the site admin page, scroll down to the repositories tab and click on the code host connections. In code host connections, what we're going to do is click on the add connection button to add a new code host connection. This will bring you to the code host selection where you can see a number of different code hosts source graph can connect to. Today, we're going to go ahead and integrate with a GitHub code host. In the code host configuration page, we can start configuring our GitHub code host. First, we'll need to provide a display name. By default, it's listed as the code host provider, and I'll leave that as is for now. Next, we'll need to provide the code host URL, as well as an access token. Heading over to our GitHub settings, I'll create a personal access token for our source graph configuration. The following scopes are required for our personal access token. Repo, workflow, read org, user email, and read discussion. After I've turned on these scopes, I can go ahead and generate our token. Now that we've created our access token, let's copy and paste that to the token field in the code host configuration. Once that's done, we can start selecting which repositories we'd like to clone and index over to Sourcegraph. We can add repositories from GitHub organizations or through matching a Sourcegraph search query, and lastly, adding single repositories from our code host. Let me go ahead and add a GitHub organization. Now, let me add some single repositories from my code host. Sourcegraph is able to sync repository permissions from the code host, but this feature will require single sign-on to be configured with Sourcegraph. Check out our single sign-on tutorial or docs page to learn more about syncing repository permissions from the code host to Sourcegraph. For now, I'll update the configuration. Once we update the configuration, we can see how many report repositories are synced, starting the syncing process from the code host. Once these repositories have been synced, the cloning and index process has started for these repositories. To find more information on how to integrate with other code hosts, head over to our documentation website. Thanks for watching this tutorial video. Be sure to check out the other training videos available when you need help or guidance using Sourcegraph.